Manicamp's virtual backgrounds feature is a great way to elevate your live stream or video calls and make them more engaging and visually appealing. In this video, I'm going to show you how to adjust your background accordingly to have the most success in your next live stream or video call. How to adjust the background size using a separate video source. If you want to adjust your background, the first thing that you must do is add a layer into Manicamp. Once you've added the layer, click on the preset of choice. I'm going to choose images and videos, and I'm going to choose this video right over here. Once the video is there, then I use my mouse and I just adjust the corners to fit the Manicam screen. I'm just going to adjust it accordingly. So once I've adjusted it accordingly, then my background is ready to go. How to adjust the layer of the person's size. Once you've chosen the background you want to use, you can also adjust the layer of the person's size. How to do that will be to add another layer onto Manicam. So right click on the preset option and choose the webcam you want to use for this video. Once you've chosen the webcam, you can go ahead and click on the virtual backgrounds tab and turn it on. Once you've turned it on, click on replace and then click on the drop down list and choose the transparent background option. Now your background will be transparent and you will only appear in the preset. Now you can go ahead and adjust yourself inside the preset to any size you may like. How to switch the background when the person's layer is still in front. For that particular layer with the person still in front, since you've chosen a transparent background option in the virtual background section, you can easily switch your backgrounds. So how to do that will be to right click on the layer in which you've set your background. Then choose the images and video option. Choose the image that you want to use. And there you go. Since the layer with the person in front has chosen the transparent background option, it will not affect that layer and then you can easily switch your backgrounds just like I did right here. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did so, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. As well, if there's any other videos that you guys would like us to make in the future, please leave us a comment down below in the comment section. And lastly, hit the bell button to get notified when we upload brand new videos. We'll see you guys next time. Bye.